my computer. Start recording. Hello, Great Twos. Uh, since Mr. Olson is still stuck in the snow, it's me again. Batman. Uh, Mr. O asked me if I could think of a way to show you how to measure mass. Uh, mass, how much something weighs. Oh, hello, bat dog. That's my bat dog. Uh, so measuring mass, I thought, hmm, how could we do this with just materials we could find around the house? So this is what I came up with. You need... Some tape. Two cups. Any kind of cup will do. Could be a styrofoam cup, a paper cup, even sour cream containers, yogurt containers, anything like that that you can put stuff in that's not too big. You need six pieces of string all the same length. And one bat hanger, or coat hanger as you might call it. Uh, I just have a plastic one here. Yeah, really any kind of clothes hanger should do. Uh, this is the one that I hang my cape on when I am not using it. Uh, so any kind of hanger that you could find. So uh, hold on for a second. I'm going to start putting some of this together and I'll show you step by step how this is going to work. So the first thing you need to do is take your three pieces of string and tape them on the three sides of your cup so that it hangs nice and straight. You're going to do that with both cups. So I've gone ahead and I've done that for both cups. Move back a little bit so you can see. I just taped them on three sides. You can see the tape. Okay, uh, then the next step is going to be attaching them to the hanger. So here we go, I've attached them to my hanger, one at each side, and I just tied them on with a knot. Uh, you could maybe glue them or staple them, but a knot is probably best because we're going to be putting stuff into the cups to see if we can compare weight or mass of objects with this thing. Uh, this is a pretty cool little bat scale, so uh, let me show you how this is going to work. So when you take some objects, I just have some, some nuts here, and I'm going to put them in this bag. And you can see that my scale moved down on the side where I put the objects in. So I can tell that this side is heavier than this side. This side is heavier than this side. If I put some into the other side it will start to balance out depending on how many objects I put in so I can compare mass of similar objects or different objects to find out which is heavier or which is lighter uh, you can hang this just from your finger to check it like I did you could put it on a doorknob you could put it on a stick anything that lets it move back and forth and that's a great way on the run if I ever have to tell when I'm out fighting crime. So when something is heavier than something else, I can quickly make a bat balance scale. Happy measuring, Grade 2's Batman.